what this means is... We're invited here to Harvard to uh, give a, a talk regarding some of our transformative and innovative technologies that are designed to uh, address growing uh, epidemics or pandemics. At Harvard, I mean, that's one of the things they are very well known for, is their innovation, their drive, you know, and trying to create something that can have an impact. They have a Global Health Catalyst program. It's really a cross-institutional program that, uh, you know, looks to close, to make collaborations that can create, uh, eliminate disparities in healthcare. Lantos is a modification for sugar. You can think uh, sugar 2.0. We know there's a growing epidemic uh, problem with obesity and diabetes and cancer-linked sugar. This was designed to fix the problem with sugar. This is sugar the way sugar intended it. Everything that we find in nature actually has one of these insulaminic or chaperone molecules in it. Say an orange, which is a type of berry, a cranberry. These compounds exist, and when we add them back to refined sugar, as nature intended, uh, to, make the, to make the sugar actually low glycemic and help fight obesity and diabetes. We actually conducted the research at the University of Sydney in Australia who are actually the originators and global experts in glycemics when it comes to sugar. While laetose is mostly actual sugar, it's low glycemic when compared to sucrose, which means the human body's accepting the sugar and it's not causing a pro-inflammatory response. So it's kind of interesting to take sugar that's glycemic and make the same product low glycemic. It tastes and performs just like regular sugar. Untrained even to an expert, it's very difficult to, to tell the difference. The sugar is very interesting because it's a global issue. Uh, so we, we're here to meet all the ambassadors who are overseeing initiatives in their own countries to, to educate them about how uh, Laetos was created. He's very passionate for global health. You can obviously see that. Like He's developing solutions that can benefit across the globe, not just in the United States. We have a thing called the National Sugar Salt Reduction Initiative to which all foods will be, re be required to be reduced in sugar by 30%. Lantos, the sugar that we designed, or Sugar 2.0, uh, actually t looks and tastes 100% like sugar, but it's 30% less sugar. It was designed to fit that role. What we should do is look at sugar the way nature designed it, and uh, that's what we've done.